Some people just can't handle that wing life, you know what I mean? Hi you guys, I'm back with another episode of What's in My Kitchen presented by Hexclad. And today I am going to be making wings. Now, they don't really have an official official name. So I'm gonna show you how I came up with this recipe and how I make them. So let's do it. I'm gonna go ahead and prep my wings. This is what I always do before I make them. Buttermilk, onion powder, garlic powder, and this one has parsley in it. A little bit of garlic salt. And then the 24 herb spice. I'm also just gonna add a little black pepper. And then I'm just gonna mix it up. I'm trying to be fancy for you guys today, but typically I'd be doing this with my hands. So it's gonna brine in there for at least an hour, hour and a half. Okay, now they go in the fridge and we will be back in about an hour. Bye. Beautiful. They're in their little brine. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do one cup of flour. I've also made this before with gluten-free flour and it's also just as good. And then half a cup of cornstarch. Now that I've made these a lot of times, the cornstarch is obviously the thing that helps them be really, really, really crunchy. Onion powder, garlic salt, garlic powder with parsley. Yum. Bragg's 24 herbs and spices. And it's just so yummy and it smells so good. I use this for so many things when I'm cooking. Like I add it to everything. So then I'm going to mix that up. So I'm gonna crack two eggs into a bowl. These eggs are from Village Marketplace in LA and it's a woman run business and enterprise. Beat these eggs. Now it's time to start dipping. And here's the process. Okay, wings are in the brine still. I'm just gonna, I gotta get in there with my hands, so it is what it is. My hands are very clean. I'm um, just gonna toss them around one more time, and then what I do is wing by wing, usually I could probably go two wings at a time. Just stick them in the egg wash, into the flour and cornstarch mix. Toss them around, make sure they're like, really coated in all of the crevices. Oh yeah. And that's how we're gonna do it. Eh. One little wing left behind. So before I started this, I preheated my air fryer to 380. Basically, you know, I'm somebody who's very much about eyeing things. I just constantly kind of pop it open and eye it and then I continuously flip them because you don't really want one side to just get a lot more cooked than the other. And I just set it at 20 minutes. If you feel that they're ready before 20 minutes, you can take them out. If you want them crispier, you can leave them longer. Obviously this is a really messy process. Like this is all under my fingernails, like really in there. Yum, yum, yum. Some people that really don't like uh, touching raw meat, which I understand because it feels bizarre, but I don't like it. Is that weird? <laughs> Fun side dishes I would recommend with the wings. I, maybe we'll make this on another episode, but I make this really yummy ranch potato salad. I love wings and potato salad. I think it goes really well together. <laughs> I gotta get under these nails because they're long and things get stuck under there. So gross. Avocado oil spray. You wanna get them really like oiled up and then spray the inside of here and here. I'm gonna use two so that I can cook all of them at once. Just make sure they're good on both sides. I'm gonna clean up my kitchen a little tiny bit. Okay, I'm just gonna clear off my board. 
sauce time. The whole base of the sauce is this Japanese barbecue sauce. I love this sauce. I put it on salmon, chicken, anything you can think of. It's delicious. So very generous amount of the barbecue sauce. A little bit of honey. I'm gonna do a little squirt of sriracha and like the tiniest, tiniest dash of cayenne. They're not fully ready yet, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna flip them again, and then I'm gonna put them back in for 10 minutes. I'm gonna go up to 400. Five minutes one side 400, five minutes the other side 400. While I'm waiting for those, I'm gonna chop some scallions. Gonna throw those in the compost. Please try these wings, because they're really, really good. I promise you, these wings are gonna do something for your life. I think these look about done. Crispy, golden, delish. Oski, what do you think? So I'm gonna get these out onto the plate. Now I want you to hear something, ready? Do you hear that crunch, crisp? They smell so good. start. I just can't help myself. I'm like too excited. So I'm just ladling over because I don't want to just dump it all on. So good. Mm. All right, now I'm going to plate them. Just give one more. Oscar! One more toss. Oh, so good. Take the remainder of the sauce. 90% of the time I'm a really good cook because then sometimes we face like a little bit of disaster. But today, that was not in the cards. Boom. Not f***ing around today. A round of applause and a one, two, three. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's time for the perfect bite. As you know, I do this on every episode. I dive in for the perfect bite, and I think I found it on this. Ooh, not that one. I dive in for the perfect bite. Already snuck like a little bite. like a little slice of heaven. I think this is the best version of my mom ever made. Not even kidding. Anywho, these wings are going crazy right now. I want everybody to try, so. Who wants a wing? Oh my God. Wow, wow, wow. Well, I think everybody's reaction spoke for itself, clearly. This is definitely the best thing I have made yet on the show, but that doesn't mean that I'm not eager to top it, so we shall see. But I had a lot of fun today, and I want to know what other recipes you want to see, what should I try. Thank you for watching this episode of What's in My Kitchen presented by Hexclad, and I will see you next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell. I like cooking, I find it relaxing, I like it soothing. Like it soothing? What the f does that mean? Love it. You can also, when you toss it, you can toss it with sesame ste steeds.
Most requested is my cinnamon rolls. A lot of people who have tried the wings have asked for them multiple times, so that says something to me. Oh, hi, Oski. I've had so much caffeine today, I feel like my eyeball's gonna fall out.